Look at this battle for the lead. They were full Johnny alive. Benson goes right by Michael Annette, takes that top spot. And we've got problems with Chad McCombie. He gets into the wall. That brings out a caution, as well as the nine of Justin Marks. And I think Chad Chaffin, that 40, was ahead of Ron Hornaday when the caution came out. So that will keep Ron Hornaday one lap down, put Chad Chaffin back on the lead lap. Look at the debris and the carnage of these two trucks. Man, what a great night Justin Marks was having. Had a great night going. Running right up front. We're getting a report that Kyle Busch in the 51 may have a tire going down. See a little bit of damage to the right front corner of that Mikasuki Toyota. They'll have to come work on that. Phil. Looks the right the right rear right tire rear's down. His right rear is down for sure. Oh, that's we got a little started. nudge right there from Ted Musgrave, and then it put Kyle up into the oh, eight the of Chad McCombie. The 99 Eric Darnell had nowhere to go, as well as the nine of Justin Marks. But we know the 51 right now has a tire going down. So that 51 of Kyle Busch will have to come back onto pit road. Check out the job the six does. What a great job by Colin Brown. He just drove around that wreck. Didn't panic, didn't lock up his brakes, just avoided it. Watch him go by right there. It, and it's not easy to, ooh, hard contact right there. It's not easy to turn that thing left and miss those guys because you're running as fast as you can at that very moment. Riding along with Eric Darnell and his Ford on board. Eric did all he could do. He, he, he couldn't turn left any harder and still got a piece of the action. And there was somebody on the underside of him, I believe, so didn't really have that access road. Take another look at what happened. There's four wide right there. Kyle Busch, the 51, gets by. Here comes Ted Musgrave with a run. He's going to get down in turn number three and is going to nudge that 51 of Kyle Busch when we get down there. I guess Kyle maybe let off a tad earlier than Ted thought he was going to because of the 07 truck, but it didn't look like uh, it looked like Ted just got in way deeper than than he should have. We ride along on the Ford onboard with Eric Darnell. This is coming out of turn two. Now, these guys right now know they're in a gob. You know, there's a lot of stuff going on. But they certainly didn't know what was fixing to happen. There's a contact right there. Kyle makes a nice save, but nowhere for Eric to, do, to go. Chad bounced off the outside wall right in front of Eric, and then Justin Marks came along as well with nowhere to go. There's another shot of it right there. Remember, this is over in turn one and two. Kyle moves to the inside of the 09 of John West Townley. Makes it three wide there. Here comes Ted Musgrave with a good run off of two. Kyle drives down in the corner. He gets in there pretty hard, yeah, and know. Musgrave still nudges him. See, hard. then the contact right there between the 51. Great save by Kyle. The eight bounces off the outside wall. Eric with nowhere to go hits him, and then Justin Marks also. There are always two sides to every story, and you were able to watch the replay with us. So your thoughts on what happened on track, Chad? Just racing, you know. Looked like the uh, 59 might have got in there a little hot and, and got into 51. They were, everybody's going as hard as they can to get as many spots as you can on these restarts. It's a tough place to pass, you know. We, I've battled the same guy for 10 laps, you know, a couple different times, you know, the tonight. And um, it's unfortunate, though. You know, we're, we're we don't have a huge fleet of race trucks, and that was a really good one. And um, so we'll just have to go work a little harder. It makes it tough, um, but you know, we'll rebound. These guys, you know, doing a great job for for uh, what we're doing here and uh, we'll come back hopefully stronger and we'll build a new one and uh, maybe it'll kick this one's butt and maybe win, win that first race. I think we're going to have a top 10 tonight and it's uh, unfortunate. We, we weren't very good to start with and tuned on it, made it a lot better. Uh, thought we were top five capable and, and I felt good about a top 10. So 